What's up everybody, I'll be reviewing a collection of eagles redone. <laughs> it's a mod that adds in a bunch of different desert eagles. Or, it adds in one type of desert eagle, but then it has mm, three different calibers, I believe. Four, I was wrong. But yeah, it also adds in three different types of new ammo, which will spawn on enemies. The .35, I mean 357 Magnum, the .440 Carbon, and then the .50 Action Express. So it adds in all these new ammos that will spawn on your opponents, and each caliber increases the damage by about, uh, let me say, an average of 500. Mm, but yeah, it's um, or not an average of 500. The DPS will be increased by average of 500. I'm sorry, I was staring at that. But the main part of this is it has a whole booty load of customization. You can choose to use either the custom animations or the vanilla animations, or you can change up all the colors and stuff, the gold, whatever you want. It's just it's pretty cool and then you could even have a scope and that's one thing that I don't think I've seen any other <clears throat> excuse me desert eagle mods with is a, a scope being able to add a scope so um right, yeah see how much damage this gun can dish out I believe this will kill a raider in one shot to the head oh well, he had a shield so that doesn't really count so any normal raider will die from one shot to the head for example he's dead Check out Super Mutant. Uh, okay. Shot to the arm of Super Mutant. There's a shield. But it's tearing them apart. I think these Super Mutants might actually have less health than the Raiders do. Or maybe they suited their armor. This gun does quite a bit of damage, but I can't even lie. Even at top tier enemies like these. Reloads pretty quickly too. Did it one-shot him? Hmm. Been a while since I reviewed a weapon that can actually one-shot one of these budget ghouls. Oh, that's disgusting. Oh. Somebody dodge that. I really apologize for that. I might just cut that out if I can. Oh, um, both of his legs that came off. This weapon is pretty strong. It shoots very quickly, too. You can just straight up shred people. I can't even imagine what the .50 caliber is like. Well, I can't imagine it. It's probably just one shot. Almost any part of the body. Shoot him in the torso a few times. See how many shots that takes. Take him on. Oh, I'm an idiot. That's strong. That always happens whenever I'm making a video. I just shoot him strong. That's one shot. Two shots. Three shots. But yeah, I have a mod that um allows creatures to burst out of things or enemies' bodies when they die. Okay, they're dead too. How many shots to your torso? You're a tank, so... And I feel like the weapon is handling you pretty well. Your turn again. Right in the booty. <laughs> Who's your red roach now? Neither one of us, because neither one of us are red roaches. But yeah, it's a pretty damn powerful gun, I can't even lie. So yeah, the weapon itself looks pretty damn sexy. Animations are on point and everything. Yeah, it's a very high quality mod. At least from what I can tell so far. As far as I've been using it. It should be about like, two hours. <laughs> nah, exaggerate. that's an exaggeration. Maybe about one hour. But um, see the reload animation. I'm going to predict that my arm will be up here. Oh, 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 oh. I'm not reloading apparently. <laughs> but it looks very, very nice. Alright, so with this Desert Eagle, you can actually go to the chemistry station. Chemistry station. <laughs> and then you could craft um, different amounts of the ammo. Of each ammo type for Desert Eagle. But you can also find these on NPCs as I've already stated. But, um. 
you can also go to finishing kits and you can craft finishing kits for various amounts of items. Um, soda gold is made out of carrots, okay then. But yeah, you can craft them for various amounts of items and yeah. That's about all, I hope you enjoyed the video. Remember to like and subscribe. Peace.